my channel so today's video is going to be a fun one i'm doing an outfit video we're transitioning into fall and i wanted to do one of my favorite um youtubers i've been watching literally since probably high school or maybe college um and that's tess christine um she's one of my favorite 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 youtubers i got into fashion and just like switched up my style because of her because i just loved it so much i always wanted to do a video um based off of like her outfits and stuff so I've been compiling a bunch of things. Fall time is like one of my favorite times. Um, her style is like one of my favorites during the fall and winter time. So, um, and that's when I kind of like to step my outfit game up anyway. Um, I got a lot of her inspiration off of um, her Instagram and then like maybe some from some videos. I, we'll see what I um, end up including in the video. But yeah, I'm super excited. Um, I also wanted to talk about her breast cancer journey really quickly. Um, she, so, background i don't know if you guys really uh knew know but um cysts run in my family having breast cysts run in my family and i hadn't gotten che mine checked out in years guys like literally years um i found a lump in my breast when i was in high school and i was terrified but i ended up going to get it checked out and it was fine and i got like tons of other like over the years i got like tons of other like cysts that popped up which technically i didn't know if they were cysts because i didn't get them checked out and literally after her coming out, um, I think it was in March, um, like her breast cancer story, it literally, I was like, I got to go. So literally thank you so much Tess for like putting that out there because I went and I ended up having to get a biopsy done. Um, and thank God, I, I, got, I think I left you all on a cliffhanger, um, but I went in and got like a biopsy done. I had the procedure done on both sides and thank God um, everything checked out great, but go get it checked like literally go get checked go get your mammograms go get your annual screenings it's super important i've got another round of biopsies i have to do next year that i'll update you guys on some other time but i just wanted to touch on that um just thanking her like so much for just giving me that push anyways needless to say get your movies checked out um and then another thing she's also like inspired me with my travel videos i used to watch her travel i watched her travel videos when she started doing them a few years ago and then like when me and my husband started traveling like i got a lot of my inspo from her so um i don't know if you guys watched my italy video um uh the title was similar to one of her titles and then i left like the description it's like do you guys know where this title is from it was from her um but anyways yeah so she's definitely one of my favorites and i'm super excited and hopefully this video turns out really well and can do her videos justice um so yeah let's get into the video so her last i'm going to be referring a lot to her last videos but her last video that she did um outfit video was more laid back and i was going to go do like this crazy like have my husband film me and stuff and i'm like you know what i'm going to take it slow and do how she did her last one and just like do be just chill because i'm more of a chill video creator anyway so yeah so um her first outfit um i have one similar this one i got from old navy years ago this cute uh basic white t-shirt and then this extra long extra large uh sweater that i got from old navy um she also had pants on i got these kind of baggy pants from they're the kindle and kylie brand um, and then also everyone else always needs basic white sneakers like this and she was wearing that as well and then jewelry rise okay i'm gonna go ahead and make a disclaimer where is my jewelry i know it is a literal crime not to have stackable jewelry jewelry i thought i had like stackable necklaces either they just disappeared i ordered some and it just didn't come in time for me to do this video like the timing of me filming this video so we're gonna pretend like I have stackable, stackable um, necklaces. So my favorite necklace here that I love to wear, um, my best, all of my best friends have these, uh, have this necklace, has this necklace with our um, initials on it. But I've noticed that she does a lot of, uh, she wears like the same uh, stackable jewelry. Love it, super cute. I have some on the way and I cannot wait to wear it. So, so this is one of my go-to necklaces i'm i'm more of like a dainty necklace kind of gal um again she does stack her jewelry a lot i i think it's so so cute and so genius so i'm gonna do that and then she typically wears like a lot of uh i've noticed that she wears a lot of the um these similar earrings i have here um and i'm gonna put them in they're kind of hard and from what i can tell they're they're gold um hoop earrings super cute so anyways 
So yeah, this is the first look. Super cute, super casual. Love it. Okay. So this next outfit is literally the perfect transition into fall. Right now in South Carolina, it's not um, super cold and it's not super hot. So you can still kind of get away with um, like wearing shorts. I've got some ripped jeans here. Um, this is literally my go-to for a summertime. I literally wore these so much this summer. Um, I don't know what brand, what brand is this? Probably Kindle, no, Shein. So I got these off of Shein. Um, literally the perfect jeans. Um, I've worn these like the last two couple summers and they're just like a, a good staple to have. And then uh, guys, this, this. I would have never thought to pair a blazer with jeans. Bag is still on there. Um, I wasn't sure if I was gonna like it, but it turned out being so cute. I just haven't worn it out. Um, but when I put it on, oh my God, literally perfect. And then she also had like a, a similar top like this one, so I'll just wear this one with it. Um, Y'all, oh my God, date night, so cute. Literally so cute. Um, and then she just paired it with uh these shoes same same kind of shoes um and then she also she also paired it with the cap i am i think it was more so like a let's see a green cap the, the closest cap that i have to the one that she was wearing is this one um and it just looks like this it has like a a rehab center on there i promise you i don't do drugs but like i just picked this up at a booth somewhere um anyways but yeah so pair it with a cute cap I thrifted this cap from Goodwill actually, so I don't know, super cute. Accessory wise, she wore the stacked jewelry and then I think she has like on some smaller hoop earrings um, than these, but I mean, these go perfectly well with them. So guys, so cute. You cannot tell me this isn't cute. Okay. Um, and then one, another thing that I like, she like recycles her like jewelry and her style. Like she doesn't have to wear like well, I don't know, this is just my impression. She doesn't have to wear like different jewelry all the time. Like she has her staple pieces and I really like that. And I'm like, I'm like that too, so. Anyways, next outfit. So the next outfit um, she is wearing, I'm also gonna wear these Kylie jeans again. I'll show a better picture of them. They're just like basic, I have no shoes on. They're just like basic, um, they're, they're not tight fitted, they're loose, but not super loose, if that makes any sense. And then the bottoms are like cut straight. I don't know, there you go. That's what the bottoms look like. This one, she just has on a basic white t-shirt uh, here. I have a short sleeve, so her, hers are long sleeve. Um, but this is like the most similar outfit that I, I could find. Um, this top is from Luca and Gray and also has like these really cute detailing on the side. Also, she layered her jewelry as well, so I'll keep this gold necklace on that I have. She also had like the cute hoop earrings. Um, and then similar jeans that I have here. And uh, it looks like she had on like a cute ring, like on her index finger and then uh, a really cute bra. So I got this bra, I don't even know where I got this from. I don't think it has a tag to say where it is from, but you could find this anywhere online. You could go risque and do it like this if you're bold enough. Or I've got like a regular bra that I got from like Target years ago that you that you could layer up under there. Uh, these really cute sunglasses. Uh, I believe I got these from Marshalls. These are my uh, one of my favorite sunglasses that I love to wear. So super cute. Um, it didn't have like what shoes she wore, but I would wear those white shoes as well simple but like little things like jewelry sunglasses to like jazz up the outfit is is a way to go this next piece is super simple um her jeans her bottoms like really reminded me of like a certain type of uh pants that i did have and i wear them like around this time of year and i know hers are black in the picture but i really wanted to like bust out these uh like kind of like suede these are obviously not real like leather or suede or whatever whatever leather or suede is that the same thing? Leather. Um, even though it's not the same color, but it just reminded me I have a pair of these kind of pants. You could also pair them with jeans if you wanted to, like black jeans. I do have some that I could do with that. And so these are from Stella Luce brand. I got these from um, Marshalls. Super cute. They are slim fitting at the bottom. It has like this cuff at the bottom here. Love wearing these with like, like a low um, nude heel. I'll wear this with or black is fine too. 
Um, and then she paired it with this kind of sweatshirt, cute sweatshirt. Um, this I believe is from Marshalls. A lot of the stuff is from Marshalls. Um, the brand is Better Together. So really cute together. Love the bagginess. This is a size medium. It's huge. It feels like an XL. So these two, these two. And then I would put them with these cute boots that I thrifted from Goodwill. So really cute together. Um, also, she had, of course, the cute hoop earrings. The ones that she had in this picture were bigger, but these are perfect to a good dupe for what she had together. And then again, she stacked her jewelry. This is my stack jewelry. Just like draw it in or imagine it, my stack jewelry. And then her other cute accessory, which you call them an accessory, was little Theo. So cute. Super cute. Okay, so this next one, like literally so cute, um, is this. Okay, so this one, she had like this really cute long, I keep saying cute, but they're all super cute, um, jacket. I remember when she did this video, um, I believe it was in a video like a while ago, uh, maybe last season, fall, last fall season, and... Uh, I literally went searching for this and found it at Marshalls. It is from the blank, blank NYC. This is in a size medium. It's an oversized like long coat. Oh my God, it was so adorable. Like, I'm like, oh my God. And it's literally just about the same um, like colors. The pattern is pretty much the same as well. Um, and I paired it with this um, like t-shirt underwear, under like cropped, cropped. I think this kind of goes a little bit below. My belly button yeah well maybe not too much but anyway this is from sincerely jewels and literally perfect and then she had on some jeans and then rolled them at the bottom you could do it that way or if you didn't want to you didn't have to um and then pair it with these boots okay so her boots are black but i mean they're so similar like pretty similar as in the colors go obviously well together so yeah oh and she had these really uh cute um jeans on i believe she got them from uh princess polly they're still available by the way if you want to buy them i just have so many jeans right now that i need to wear before i buy any more jeans so so you could do that um she also has a stack jewelry of course and then the some hooped earrings um no jewelry except her wedding ring and yeah and the cute hooped ones so all right so for this last outfit um she had on this Really nice top. Again, I love how she's casual. Like she dresses up casual so nicely and so, so cute. Um, so I, it's not the same color, but I have found, oh, backwards. Or is it backwards? No, it's not backwards. Um, it's like this knitted, really cute knitted top. Um, this was like the closest I could find that I have. This brand is Willow and Wind. And it goes like that. And then she also had some cute jeans on just like basic jeans you know you could do baggy jeans um you know <laughs> um this is a little bit of a more of a crop shirt but i mean anything similar would go um she had on a sweater i could not find a sweater like this like i have one but it's pink and obviously pink is not going to go with this um so if you have like a really cute knitted sweater you could also do a, also do a cardigan i just didn't have a cardigan that i felt would go well with this um and then she had on her stack jewelry of course my stack jewelry is coming um, and then hoop earrings not quite similar similar to these but um or not quite like these they're like a little bit different i think yeah they're more of like a solid this has more of a i don't know like this <laughs> i can't describe that um, um i don't know what shoes she's wearing it looks like she has on white shoes so obviously you could pair it with any kind of white shoes or so i'm i would wear these with it and sunglasses one of my favorites that i got from marshall's so all right guys that is the end of my tess christine um outfit look alike video i hope you guys enjoyed i really enjoyed doing this video it was super fun um let me know which was which is your favorite outfit that i did i literally think the one with the long um jacket was the best like literally my best yet um but anyway thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys